uh, good morning good afternoon good evening based on your time zone today we are going to talk about http call out into the flow builder without code in sprint 20 through salesforce introduced a new http uh, call out beta element into the flow builder let's see how we can use that for that first of all like you need to create a permission set and authorize the api which you want to use for demo purpose, we are planning to use uh, this official jog API, API which we can use, which actually give us random jog every time. So let's see how we can do it. So first step is create a permission set. So let's create a permission set, which we, which will be authorize the user to use this API. So click on the permission set. And then click on new demo chalk api so i'm using that click on save and now next step is create the uh, name credential or external credential for that just go to the name credentials under the name credential, uh, just go to the external credential first. So click on the name uh, external credential, say demo jog API. You can give whatever the name. So here you have an option. Um, uh, API which I am going to use is unauthorized. Uh, we don't need any authorization for it. For that, um, you, I'm going to use custom, but if you are using O2, you can select the O2 option and then con, uh, provide all the necessary detail. But for this demo purpose, I'm going to use custom and click on save. And once you click on save, now it's time to assign the same permission set to yourself. Now click on the permission set mapping, click on new, and then uh, give the name, <coughs> permission set name. It's my demo joke API, and then click on save. Once you save it, now it's time to create the name credential where you will assign that all uh, uh, API URLs and everything. So click on the name credential again. And now click on the new. Give the name demo joke API. And then you need to provide the URL. For this URL, just provide the base URL. So go here provide the base URL, give the name here and then select the uh, demo joke API which we just created. If you are using other authentication for certification base and all, you can configure accordingly. But for me, I'm just clicking on save. So when this is done, uh, don't forget to assign the permission set to yourself. So as I'm going to use this, I'm going to assign this to myself. Assign to create the flow. So let's see how we can do it. For this demo purpose, let me go and create a screen flow. So I'm going to create a screen flow click on new and once you click on new uh, it's time for uh, calling the http call out making the http call out so click on this and then click on action once you click on action you will be see the new option create http call out beta click on this and then specify i'll give the name demo job api and then select the name credential which we just created and it will be show you which api we are going to call then click on next and then label uh, give the invocation method name so i'm saying get jock and then select the method we are going to use the get method and then you need to provide the url so for the url uh, what api we are going to use is the uh, random job so provide the exact url so it will make a call on this particular api and if you need to pass any query parameter or any particular parameter over there, you can also use this. But as of now, for my uh, my API callout, I don't need to pass anything. But take an example, if you are using uh, address validation or something like that, you might need to pass the address and something. And once you are done, 
one last step you need to do is provide the sample response so go to your api copy the sample uh, copy the sample request and response from here and then paste it in the flow builder click on new and paste it here so this is my sample response click this so it will be uh, passing like four parameter i'm getting and click on done and then click on done and then just provide the name element for this so let's say uh, demo job call out and then click on done so once it will make a call out it will be get all this uh, four parameter for you now let's see how we can display so for displaying thing like we can use the screen element and we can use the text display text over here so in the display text let's say question and then uh, if you remember this is the call out we created and this is our response and the response we are getting that four parameter so let's say this setup and to give the answer there was one more parameter we use let's say this one and jog click on the resource select response and punchline so this will be the punchline and click on done okay so give the name and click on done so this is what will be make a call out get the two path two thing one is the setup which will be cast the question and another will be the punchline and once we'll commit it will be display over here here let me connect make a looping so that it will be give multiple job for me so let me connect this with the uh, job call out again and click on save and now demo http call out click on save now let's see and debug it so now you see it is asked it is showing uh, the question what is it is short for then answer is coming the joke is coming now you can click on next it will ask another question and it will be given another punchline so you can see this all things are coming from the http call out and uh, you can use the name credentials and make it more secure for the authentication part or you can use the certification but for the demo purpose i use unauthenticated one so that we can see how it's work out thank you everyone